What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying. Um, this is a channel reading. Taps through side to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, that apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. Uh, free general reading. So it's very important to only take the messages that resonate. Um, thanks, everybody, for all the love and support uh, to the channel. Every like, subscribe, share, um, donation, everything. You guys are just the best. And all the emails for the news links, too. I forgot to put that in there. All the emails to the news links as well. You guys are just the bestest. Um, I love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. All the support. All the Everybody that's um, just recently came into the channel. Welcome in. I hope the channel helps you in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, I'm not doing just a little update real quick before we get into this. I'm not currently doing sign weekly sign readings like I was doing because I got a spiritual message download for myself. For anybody that doesn't know this, I have put it publicly on here, but I'll say it again. Um, uh, just recently, just a, hasn't been even a week ago, to quit doing sign readings because um, there's apparently frauds out there trying to copy people's work. So. Um, so I'm not, I heeded the spiritual advice. Of course, everybody can heed the spiritual advice for their own personal preferences and own personal situation. I am personally heeding it. So I'm not doing sign readings right now. I was doing weekly sign readings. I'm not. Of course, everybody has free will and they can do what they want to do, but I'm not. So just to let y'all know. Now, when I reopen them back up, I will let you know, and I will open up personal readings shortly. Um, probably within the next few days is um, my presumptive, guessing on this just to let everybody know but they are currently closed right now okay all right so the channel message i received was um uh a reader a, a current tarot card reader that does not receive clear audience third eye is about to open in a huge 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 way I heard it was already opening and it's about to basically about to blow open is what it sounds like it's about to open in a huge way meaning it's about to blow open it's about to blow open so whoever this is your third eye you're a current tarot card reader and you're not receiving it sounds like um clairs right now um but it's but your third eye has been it sounds like it's been the process of opening but it sounds like it's about to blow open and you're about to start receiving clear audience which is the hearing um from spirit, channel messages from spirit, hearing wise. Now, for anybody who doesn't know, there's many clairs. Um, usually, if you have one, you have more than one. Um, but some readers and some people, you don't have to read. You can be anybody. But you, if your third eye is open, you are able to receive gifts from the spiritual realm, basically. If the spiritual realm decides to bless you with them. That's how it works for anybody who doesn't know. But whoever you are, you're a reader, and you haven't, it don't sound, don't sound like you have any clairs yet, but you're about to start receiving clear audience, which is hearing from the spiritual realm. Um, and that's beautiful. So whoever you are, you could read on a public platform. I feel you're probably reading on a public platform for some of you guys. For some, you could just read in the privacy of your home. But you're currently reading, like reading cards, either for yourself, privately, um, or publicly. How about that resonates? But Third eye is already opening. It's about to blow open. You're about to start receiving clear audience, which is hearing from the spiritual realm, spiritual downloads, hearing wise, like me. So, like I said, there's many clairs. There's clairvoyance. There's visions. There's many uh, readers that do have visions, um, and I get visions from time to time. There's um, clear sentience. There's um, clear uh, uh, psychic medium abilities. There's um, uh, dreamscape abilities, and there is a smell player two, which I cannot remember the name of that one. So you have to plug it in how it resonates. Um, but you're a reader, whoever you are. Um, you're about to basically start getting clear audience is what I heard. Um, and then I heard um, someone that does not read is about to start receiving clear um, audience as well. So you plug it in how it resonates. So somebody that does read either privately or publicly is about to start reading, um, receiving clear audience, which is hearing from the spiritual realm. And somebody that does not read is about to start receiving clear audience, which is hearing from the spiritual realm. Now, it's all for whoever this is for, it's all in how you manifest it. It's all in how you manifest it, you guys. 
Um, for anybody who doesn't know, I started receiving spiritual realm abilities in a approximately April of 2020. I started my channel in March of 2020. I started receiving mine in April 2020. Um, I did not enjoy it, enjoy it at first. I to be honest with you, I didn't. Now I love it. It's the best thing ever happened to me. It's really changed my life in many wonderful, positive ways. Um, so congratulations to whoever that's for. But it's however you manifest it, though, for whoever this is for, whether you read or you don't. It's however you manifest it and grow it. Um, and I, I'm speaking from personal experience there. So I just, I'm getting, receiving this download for somebody for a reason. I feel like I need to say this. It's how you grow and manifest it, okay? So you plug it in, however that resonates. We have creation on the bomb deck. I have not shuffled them yet. I think that's the um, third eye about to be blown open. The third eye is about to be blown open. Whether you read or you don't read, you're about to start receiving downloads, clear audiently. So you're going, so you're going to experience, you're going to see for your own self, whoever you are, how it like what I'm doing over here, basically. Um, and I think that's pretty awesome. Whoever you are, um, congratulations to whoever that's for, because um, that's awesome. I love to see people of my kind. <laughs> so that's great. Whoever, whoever you are, I would love to know. Um, of course, you don't have to tell me. Um, for privacy and confidentiality, but I would love to know if you want to tell me. Self-reflection, I think you're about to look back and um, I think you're about to understand the people with clear uh, audience abilities, how it's about to work. Um, that's exactly what I think. I think you're about to have some memory lane trips back to memory lane before you started receiving clear audience. Uh, whoever you are, it hasn't happened yet. It sounds like it's about to. Um, and you're about to self-reflect basically back, or maybe for some of you, um, and I didn't hear this, but I feel maybe for some you um, made fun of Claire readers possibly in the past. I didn't hear that you did, but I feel maybe for some you did possibly, but you're about to start receiving the same exact abilities. Now, I want to warn whoever this is for, your abilities can be taken away from the spiritual realm. They give you the abilities, they can be taken away. So, if you go around doing, doing crazy, crazy crap in the universe, acting like cray-cray, they will take them away. So, um, you have to grow and hone and manifest yourself and your body in a proper way in order to uh, keep the abilities just to let whoever this is for know um, if you did not already know that. So, just a little FYI, reader or not reader, okay? Self-reflection. Spirit messages you have reflected. Congratulations. That's too many. Too many. The void reversed. I don't think you're going to be depressed about it. I think you're going to be happy. And um, clear audience messages, they really, they're beautiful when you do the readings. Um, and some readings, for anybody that's been me a hot minute, you know, some readings, I don't even use cards. I just get on here and, and channel it in. Um, it's really beautiful spirit messages you have, collected, but it's how you handle it. It's how you handle it. There's, it's too many. It's too many. Maybe you've had a lot going on in your life that has blocked your third eye in the past is what I'm feeling because I'm getting out. I was getting out, um, lots of cards so i'm feeling for some you you had a ton going on in your life you were super super busy and maybe that's what was blocking your third eye maybe there was so much chaos and conflict in your life you wasn't able to properly meditate wasn't able to properly um relax and breathe and center yourself in order to have your third eye blown blown open is what i'm feeling number 10 or 3 could be very significant numbers in your life in some shape form or fashion 10 or 3 these could be possible ages of uh, a child of yours or somebody you're connected to possibly uh 10 and 3 could also be possible lottery number date of birth number so security card number green card number jersey number etc uh 10 and 3 and also 10 is completion of cycles so completion you're about to level up whoever you are you're about to level up spiritually and i'm serious so completion of old cycle starting a new cycle you're about to level up spiritually congrats discernment I think I'm going to, I think I'm going to title this video, Leveling Up. Oh. 
Someone that's about to receive these clairaudient abilities is about to have huge regrets of the past. For some, they were evil and malicious to a current clairaudient person, but they're about to really, really understand. For some, they will reach out to them. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Wow. So whoever you are um, that's about to receive these clairaudient abilities, uh, masculine or feminine, reader or not, I heard you were, um, you're going to have some regret once you start receiving them because you were evil and malicious, I heard in the past, to um, a fellow clairaudient person. So um, somebody that has clairaudient abilities as well. Um, but you're going to understand once you receive them yourself, you're going to understand how it works. You're going to understand um, the process because you're going to be going through it too. And I heard for some, you're going to actually reach out to this person um, or people, how that resonates. So discernment, um, you're going to be able to discern. You're going to be able to discern more clearly, I feel. Now, for some, it could, you know, it's really all in your level of cognitive ability and mental capability. If you're really sharp and you're really sharp-minded and really intelligent and really mentally there, you can, it's really, you know, you can discern it. You can get it. I mean, it, sometimes it takes some practice. I'm not going to lie. It took me some practice at the beginning. Um, and I, it was hard for me. I didn't want them. I didn't want them. I just, they just came to me. I didn't want them. <laughs> um, but if I could go back in time, I would want them in a new minute, is what I'm saying. It's just, I wasn't, I didn't, I was too 5D focused before I gained them, is what I'm trying to say. I was too 5D focused. I was focused all on the world, all on um, material things. I was so focused, 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 focused on everything but spirituality, is what I'm trying to say. But if I could go back and turn back the hands of times, I would in a New York minute. But, you know, like I said, it took me growing, growing and learning to um, incorporate them in because I was reading before I gained them and, um, and I was a very new reader. So um, <laughs> it's been a learning growing process for me, but it's been the best thing that ever happened to me. But I'm trying to put this out here for somebody because I feel you might be one of my subscribers. I've, I'm pulling this in for a reason. So I feel you're one of my subscribers. So I wanted to help you because I didn't have this video when I began, um, started um, receiving clear audience messages from the spiritual realm. That's what I'm saying. I didn't have this to look at. So hopefully this helps somebody is what I'm saying. But I heard at least one of you guys is going to reach out to the person that basically you made fun of, you downed, you blah, 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 blah in the past that had the clear audience before you. Um, and reach out to them. I think to mend fences, to to con conversate about it, to heal heal it is what I'm thinking. Realization. It's going to cause a huge, huge, huge wake up call in you. Huge. For some, you're going to start reading. Wow, okay, I heard it's going to cause a huge, huge, huge wake-up call in you, and for some, you're going to start reading. So for some, like I said, you are current readers, you're going to gain the abilities, clear audience. For some, you're not readers, and you're going to gain clear audience, and uh, it's going to cause such a huge wake-up call in some of you guys, you're going to start reading. So you, when, yeah, I mean, as long as you grow and hone the manifest, the abilities correctly, because like I said, I've seen readers that have had their, take, reader, um, their abilities taken away, and it's, I would never want that. I would never, 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 um, never. So um, as long as you, you know, aren't going out being crazy and wild in the 5D, you know what I'm saying? So you plug it in how it resonates. I'm not saying you can't have fun in 3D. I'm not, I meant 5D. I meant 3D, 3D, ah, it was 5D. I'm not saying you can't have fun in 3D. You can absolutely have fun in 3D. You just got to do it in a correct way. That's what I'm trying to say. You got to do it in a correct way. So you plug it in how it resonates. Okay. I think we're done. All right, you guys. I love you guys so freaking much. I like I said, I mean, I'm not saying be boring. Be boring. Absolutely not. I don't want boring for anybody. 
um, you know, I, and there's different levels. There's different levels of spirituality, different levels of leveling up, different levels of ranking up in the spiritual realm and any realm for that matter. Um, but, you know, if you go out, I, I mean, I'm presuming if you go out and you, um, you know, you're in friggin', uh, I don't know. I'm just using an example. You go out, you're like, oh, yeah, well, I got clear on this. I'm going to get on here. I'm going to start a tarot card reading. I'm going to make a lot of money. And then you're on here strictly for the money. I mean, yeah, the money's nice and you should be paid very well in the spiritual realm. Absolutely. freaking lulu. But then you come on here and claim love and light. And then that weekend you go out and you're drunk as a skunk and you perform, you know, you're getting, um, I don't know, um, company of 10 men, two and three at a time in your hotel room man or woman, I'm trying to be, not, I'm trying not to be crass on here. You know what I'm talking about. Um, and, you know, and you are snorting up 10 lines of coke, then that's not living the spiritual life is what I'm trying to say. So I could pre only presume that one would probably get their abilities taken away is what I'm trying to say. Um, and someone's been taking mushrooms to gain abilities. It's about to backfire on them in a huge way. Oh, God. Whoa. And I heard someone's been taking, um, somebody's been doing shrooms. Some, somebody's, oh my God. Somebody's been doing shrooms to gain abilities, but I heard it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. Now, anybody doesn't know shrooms, like mushrooms, like, like shroom shrooms, um, like drug shrooms, um, that come from pastures of cow manure. By the way, for anybody didn't know that, that is for real, for real. Uh, yikes um but somebody's been taking shrooms to gain abilities but i heard that's about the backfire on them in a huge way yeah no nay nay that's not how you gain abilities you guys that's not how you gain abilities and i'm sure it is probably going to backfire on them in a huge way they're probably going to have some crazy trip or something um whatever i don't know i've never done shrooms never have no desire of doing shrooms yikes all right you guys we're done i love you guys so much hope this helped and namaste